Watch with you, yeah. Black for TV. You're with who? Black for TV. Yeah, awesome. Well, you are someone who's so influential. What is something that you learned from Clarence about, you know, honing that sort of influence and? Well, Clarence and I are from the same hometown, and I think um, being from the South and being from a, I would say, mid-sized city, um, you know, he has that that touch of wanting to stay in in uh, contact with the community, wanting to give back. Uh, I was raised the same way, so I would say, you know, he's he's elevated that sense of. Um, of giving back in my life, and um, he's just he's just such a great role model for us all. Awesome, and it feels like you've given back to all of us. I mean, BET oh. is huge and influential. Um, what has life been like after BET for you? Uh, it's been great. Uh, I'm able to focus on some projects that uh, I'm excited about. I'm doing a couple of corporate boards, but I'm focused on my Leading Women Define conference, where I try to inspire and uh, elevate uh, prominent African American women. I've uh, been working with the Grammys and on their diversity and inclusion task force. So I've been able to do a lot of different things. Awesome. And, you know, with Twitter, I feel like the, the landscape has changed a little bit with, you know, political figures coming out and speaking out against it. You're on the board. What, how is, you know, what are your thoughts right now? What's going on with Twitter in that whole aspect? Uh, well, I think Twitter is, is, as we know, very focused on health and security on the platform and trying to figure out how to... Um, engage different points of views but protect users um, so that's a, a real priority for the company right now awesome well thank you so much for speaking with us take care